hey, hey, YouTube, welcome back to Arabin Outdoors. I'm Arabin, but you knew that, didn't you? Today I'm going to talk about this master sportsman paddling PFD. When I want to buy something, I like to do research on YouTube and see what other people say about the product before I spend my money on it. I got this at Walmart. It's made by a company called Master Sportsman. You can see the logo here. The company is out of Boulder, Colorado, but this was made in China. If you are interested in a good PFD at a great price, this is one for you. This is a paddling vest, okay? It's a universal fit, so it'll fit just about any body size. I bought this for my kayak. As a matter of fact, I went kayak fishing today. It was very windy, not the best conditions, but I was able to bring home these guys. Not a bad day. Any day fishing is a good day, but when you catch fish, it's even better. Well, back to the vest. All right, so this vest, like I say, it's a paddling vest. You can see how big the arm area is. Plenty of mobility for paddling, okay? There's so it's, it doesn't come way out to your shoulders or way up top here. It's very comfortable. It sits higher. I'll show you the back. You can see how high the back fits. At the bottom portion of the back, it does have mesh, which helps it to be cooler. But the reason I like the higher back is because when I sit in my kayak, the chair or the seat of the kayak comes up no higher than the light vest actually starts. And that makes it a lot more comfortable to sit in because your back can actually lean up against the seat, not up against the light vest, up against the seat. So it's more comfortable for sitting in a kayak. And that's what it was made for. It's got a nice heavy zipper. It is a plastic zipper, so you don't have to worry about rust or anything. It does have one of the knife clips here. Now this isn't the knife that I'm normally going to have. I have this knife right here in my Amazon cart right now just waiting for my next payday. That's the uh, Gerber River Shorty and it is going to clip on right here. I'll put it upside down or I'll probably put it sideways. I don't know. If you see the way it is, you can put it this way, like this, or you can put it like that. Now today I just used this Tac Force knife. Any knife with a clip will work. You can just clip it on, and it stays nice and secure. So if you need a knife to cut your line or whatever, it's right there, readily accessible. That's what I like about this vest. Everything is right here. You've got two huge pockets here in the front and in one pocket I have a pair of glasses so if I have to re-tie a line I have to have glasses to see to do that I also keep my phone in this pad and I could put I had a pack of crackers in there earlier um, so you've got the deep pocket there it unzips and folds out as you can see it's got the double zippers and the same on the other side big pocket and it unzips two zippers you flap it out now look what I can put in here I've got my mini tackle box so in this tackle box it's a two-sided tackle box I've got beetle spins rooster tails hooks weights uh, swivels a couple of bobbers assorted hooks on the other side, I have a little, a little knife um, and multi-tool. It's the uh, little Gerber. It's got a little screwdriver and knife. Keep some lip balm, 
and then always a damn big lighter. So, uh, this little tackle box is made by Plano, and it fits perfectly in this pocket right here. Zips up, no worries. So, if I get snagged, I have to take my knife, cut my line, and I have to put on a new lure or new weights and hooks. It's all right here. I don't have to worry about turning around in the kayak, reaching way back there, pulling out a bigger tackle box. Everything is right here. Just unzip, open up, get what I need, put it back, and go back to fishing. Also, on the outsides of each pocket, there's another or two more little pockets right here where you could slide things down in there. Haven't found a use for those yet, but, uh, you know, each one has little pockets there that you can slide things down in. Two on each side, and it's just held by Velcro. You also have these little loops right here. I'm not exactly sure what they're for, but I think what you could do with them is this. Uh, I think you could take a uh, lure and you could hook it like that. So if you wanted to have a lure uh, handily available so you can just reach up and grab it if you need it instead of having to go into the tackle box. I think that's what these little things are for. It's got on this side and then it's got three holes on this side and then also on the pockets there are two you can see so you can hook things on to those at least that's what I'm thinking they're for if you know exactly what those things are for let me know personal flotation device is very important uh, that's what PFD stands for or it could have another meeting if you choose not to wear it at all, and I'm sure you've heard this, if you wear a PFD, it stands for personal flotation device. Or it prevents from drowning. But the other meaning it can have is if you don't wear it, it's pretty freaking dumb PFD. But with a trach, I needed a reliable, comfortable, affordable, functional, PFD and I found it in the Master Sportsman. I used it for the first time today and I paddled for a couple of hours and fished. I would highly recommend that you check out the Master Sportsman paddling PFD and uh, it's available at Walmart for $34.97 I believe. It's a great product I wouldn't tell you so if I didn't believe it, and I just wanted to share it with you. So if you're looking for a personal flotation device for paddling, and you don't want to spend an arm and a leg, check it out. Master Sportsman. That's all I got for you today, guys. Till next time, keep calm, carry on, and keep it outdoors.